All right, today I am running a simulated tournament. I've got a tournament coming up here next week. It's gonna be in this spot almost exactly a week from today. And it's gonna be starting here and then moving around down in the area. But uh, basically I'm gonna do what I would do during the tournament. I'm carrying the gear I'm carrying that I'm going to be carrying then. And I uh, just wanna see if there's a bite in the area. I'm gonna give myself two hours. The tournament's gonna last three hours, but I think if I can catch a limit in two hours, I think I'll do really well in the tournament, so. Uh, but that's if I catch a limit. I really don't believe anybody's gonna catch a limit for this tournament. So, I'm going with uh, actually a skinny Senko on a, a weighted EWG jig head. It's almost like putting a bullet weight or a split shot on, in front of a Senko Texas rig. So it'll, it'll work the same, same way. So I'm really here to see how much ground I can cover in two hours. That way I've got a little flexibility when I get three hours. That's why I'm limiting myself. It's 5.30 now and I've got till the tournament's gonna end at 7.30. Although right now it is the hottest part of the day. It's 104 degrees right now. Hopefully the tournament day it'll be a little bit cooler. Maybe we'll get some rain. The rain would really, really help things out. Definitely helped out the last time I was down in this area. In fact, I'll show those clips right now. I was getting a lot of bites. I only landed, well, technically didn't really land anything. They all slipped off, but I had hooked two bass and foul hooked a really big carp. I'll go ahead and show those, uh, that footage right now. Oh, there we go. There we go. So I got him. I got him. I landed him. It's a little bitty bass. Oh, and he slipped off. Set himself free. But, hey, I got one. and didn't take me very long. Yeah, they're in here. Nothing, nothing huge, but... Yeah. Like, I just caught one a minute ago. It was probably about that long. It was a little bass. So... But then, just up there, there's like a, a dam. And on the other side of that, I've caught big bass. So, actually, they had a bite right there. Ah, I got one. Yep. <laughs> oh, and he slipped off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I think my hook might be a little dull from snagging stuff, so that might be why they're slipping off. There's another snag, which is weird. I was doing pretty good there, not getting any snags, and then all of a sudden I'm snagging everything. There we go. No? Thought I had it there, but nope. Actually, oh, what? I think I actually got a fish there. Whoa, that is pulling drag. I've definitely got something. What is that? I thought I was snagged. But it was buried in the... Ah, I foul, foul hooked me a pleco. Whoa. Look at the fight on this. I've always wanted to hook one of these. Oh no, that's not a pleco. What is that? Oh, I got me a carp. <laughs> Look at this. This is a... This is probably a f four or five pound carp right here. Uh, no, did he get off? I don't think so. Try to get him over here where I can... Oh, yeah, he slipped off. Damn. I released the tension a little bit so I can come around and try to pick him up. But that was... That was the best fight I've had on this little rod for sure. Kind of sucks I wasn't able to land him. I was trying to bring him over here where I could reach him. But I messed up on that. Big old catfish and some big tilapia. Oh, come on. Oh, man. I don't believe that. Big catfish just swam up and grabbed my Senko when I went to set the hook. He, he darted off.
There is a... Stay on, stay on, stay on, stay on. Swimming towards me, whatever it is. Yeah, it's a bass. All right. Yep. Nice quad. Nice fat one, too. A little bit of a funky mouth there. Nice fat, thick wide. Looks like a lot like a small mouth. Very dark. But it's green. Small mouth, small mouth or brown. The best thing about this area for the tournament is it's not necessarily the fishing, because the fishing is going to be pretty tough, but there's plenty of shade, which is one of the main reasons why the tournament's going on here because there's, there's going to be places for you to get into the shade and keep cool. And uh, like I said, the tournament's about a week away, but I've already got a couple of videos scheduled to come out over the next week or so, or two weeks. And uh, if the tournament goes well and I'm actually able to get some good footage out of it or something, I'll make because I don't make a video out of every tournament, but if this one ends up being a video tournament, then you'll see that tomorrow the day after this video comes out so if not then uh yeah i don't know what the next video is going to be tons of bait fish over here there we go that'll get me on the board yep and of course he took the the bait from me but that's all right that's I mean, that's not a very big one but that's about 12 inches uh hopefully i would have been able to get a picture of him before he got away otherwise he wouldn't count for the tournament <laughs> but there we go i got one this area here under the waterfalls and stuff i think this is going to be the most productive area just because the water is going to be stirred up it's probably going to be a little cooler because it's moving and it's going to be stirring up the food. So I think this is where the fish are going to be hanging out mostly. Oh, there we go. Oh my God. Look at that. That is a monster. For this river anyway. Oh. That's what I'm looking for for the tournament. That is a good 16, 17 inches solid two pounder. There we go. Wow. That caught me off guard. I wasn't expecting anything like that. <laughs> but, uh,. Yeah, let's hope we can pull in a couple of those during the tournament. <laughs> One. It's right there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, got a. It's probably about 17, 18 inches. Bass. Bass. Yeah. Uh, just artificial lures. Stick a yeah. The one I'm using right now is a skinny Sanko Is what it's called. Oh, so. Yeah. It's like a worm, basically. But actually, the one I caught, I caught that one on a uh, craw. Like a crawfish style. Nice. What a. What color are you using? Uh, green. Like green pumpkin. Green pumpkin. Yeah. Nice. Picture didn't really come out very well, but there you go. 
<laughs> oh, there you go. Oh, that's a good one. I have to brighten that up later. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> you too. Oh, I nailed that perfectly in that location. It's a little weird point. Yep. Oh. I knew there'd be something hanging out in that point right there. Yep, there it goes with it. Got him. Oh, it's just a sunfish, but that's a nice one. Uh, I think that's a red-eared sunfish. Maybe a long ear. But now I'm just gonna keep walking and look for anything that that might create some kind of shelter for a fish. Like that, there, that fish was living in that spot. And I think I see something across the way over here. Looks like a pipe that's buried just under the surface. Oh, I got right in front of it. Uh, let's see. Yep. Oh. And this boat's about to ruin it. And these boats are the reason why that fish was hanging out in that little corner and there's a fish hanging out in that pipe right over there it's the only shelter they're provided from these boats just landed next to the pipe not exactly where i wanted it to be but it should might work whatever that was felt like a pretty sizable fish maybe a really big sunfish or small bass there we go I think it's a bass. Yep, there we go. <laughs> hmm? What is that? It's a largemouth bass. Oh, no way. <laughs> that is so cool. <laughs> Can't you release or you I release them. Oh, yeah. yeah. So. <laughs> Alright, I think this is about where I'm going to call it a day for now. Maybe during the tournament I can get a little farther out. Probably not. I think this is where I'm going to draw the line and then I'll fish my way back. But I did hit, at least got some bites from at least from a ton of fish. Got a lot of bites. Landed three bass and one pretty good sunfish. Lost another bass. I think if I can do that during the tournament, especially that big one, if I can land something like that again, I'll do pretty well. 